All right, we got Andrea's fine video here. It's a 64 and a half convertible Mustang. It's a four speed rock crusher in it. Pay attention, Neil. With a small block. Uh, that is a convertible. It does have a title. It is a little bit rusty now. It does uh, need some parts on this one. But it does have a good title. Uh, <clears throat> it is an original four speed car. All the convertible top components are there. The, the framework, the hydraulics are all good. This quarter panel has been replaced on the driver's side. It needs a quarter on the passenger side. It is rusty. Looks like it's got some traction bars on there, a dry shaft loop, some headers, some old thrusters that are a little rusty there. Uh, you know, the rockers are a little rusty. Boards are a little rusty. It's got one decent trim on this side. The convertible top trim's pretty nice. Uh, it's pretty much what you see. You know. Here's the passenger side quarter panel. It's definitely rough in the back. It's rusted, rusted. Uh, the doors don't line up very well. This would be like a title type deal. You know, you'd be buying a lot of parts for this one, but it is a 64 and a half. It is a V8 car. And uh, if you're interested in this one, let Andrea know. Uh, yeah, I was trying to see what kind of rear end we got in here. It looks like somebody's put a 9 inch in there. Doesn't look like an 8.8 .8 anymore. So, it's had some uh, modifications. So, I'll try to give you a shot at the bottom. I'm not trying to hide anything. It's obviously got some rust for sure. In the new floor. Rear frame rail, uh, they look a little weak too to me. I probably have to replace the rails. Uh, same with the front. But it is what it is, so if you guys are interested, let her know. Ugh. Andrea's finds. Good scoop. Okay. Okay. So here we go. Old school racer. Lots of work. Might be for you. No headlights. No headlights, got the buckets, got the bumper, got the grill assembly. Uh, your shock tower over here has got some uh, brazing, some work done. Uh, it is straight behind the hinges. Uh, it doesn't look like it ever has been wrecked. It just is rusty. So there you go. That's about it on this one, guys. A little more of the interior. Yeah, let him put that down. There you go. I think I'm getting it all. There's the hydraulic motor for the top and stuff back there. So that's it for this one, guys. If you're interested, let Andrea know. And uh, she'll get you some more information. I wouldn't open anything on it. Anything you open could fall off. Maybe he's got it. What are you worried about? What are you looking for? I want to run the well, you'll have to get that off the body somewhere. Anyway, she's going to try to get the VIN number, make sure the title's all correct. But, uh, so we got this top loader four speed in here. This looks like a later model 302. Might be a 289, I'm not really up on the Fords. So, uh, there you go.